Alright, what's going on? Here, man, how are you? Right, tell me who you are. Uh, my name's Julian Lewis Jones. I'm uh, an actor and a uh, good at presenting, producing, and I'm here for a film called Jungle Cry. Oh, yeah, so, uh, so, so I'm an actor um, in this film, Namibia. Um, right, we're going to do some uh, question and answer. So, <clears throat> what's been the best um, drama or thing you've done in your career? Um, probably the most memorable and, and high profile. I did a film called Invictus uh, nine years ago. God. We filmed it in South Africa and it was directed by Clint Eastwood. And the main stars of it were Morgan Freeman and Matt Damon. <laughs> and um, I played... Um, Nelson Mandela, who's uh, played by Morgan Freeman, I played his bodyguard. Mad. Um, one more question. Um, I'm trying to think. Do you like w- when you first started? Like, obviously, this like my first time ever doing like um, extra things. Yeah. What was like your start? Did you have to do extra, in or did you just get put straight into it? Well, it's it's, it's different really because I decided to become an actor when I was 22. So um, I went to drama school. When I was 23, I went to Royal Welsh College of Music and Drama in Cardiff. Yeah. Then I trained there for three years, and then I started doing um, sort of parts on TV, like Casualty and Soldier Soldier and stuff like that. Then I did. Um, I went up to do theatre then, which is where I really learned about acting. Um, I got to do a lot of plays up at uh, a place called Theatre Cluid up in North Wales, and. The guy that started it called, well, he started like a Welsh ensemble company, like a rep company up there called uh, Terry Hands. And so I started doing plays up there and, and I did quite a bit of theatre for a few years. Yeah. And then I was still doing TV at the time, but uh, and then I started getting a few high profile jobs, TV and then films and like Invictus. And, and then I managed to work then, you know, obviously with Clint Eastwood. I, I did um, a movie called Zero Dark Thirty with Catherine Bigelow. <laughs> I did uh, Eagle with Channing Tatum. And I, a couple of years ago, ago I did um, Justice League with Zack Snyder. Wow. So I've, I've been lucky, I've been fortunate to work with fantastic directors. Um, when you go out in public, mm-hmm. um, go down the shops or something, do you get asked to take pictures and stuff? Or do you find that struggle or is it just like rarely or... Do you find it I hard think, to go out in public? No, it's fine. You know, it's like I um I generally tend to sort of look different in, in a lot of stuff I do anyway. So people kind of do have that kind of second take. Yeah. You know, they kind of look at you and go, I know him from somewhere, sort of thing. But um but no, ninety nine percent of the, the public are, are lovely. And I you know, I'm I'm very approachable and easy to talk to and it doesn't bother me at all. It's it goes with the territory, you know, if you're gonna be in the public eye, then you've got to expect to, you know, be nice to people, and it's, it's not an issue. Yeah. Um, so, so here on Jungle Cry now, what do you think of the setup for this? Do you are you looking forward to when this film's going to be coming out? Yeah, I think it's going to be coming out sometime next year. I have heard rumours of the Cannes Film Festival. Yes. So that would be nice. Yeah. I don't know if any Namibian players will be going. There, <laughs> you know what I mean, uh, we're they, too good they, for that. We're too good. Uh, they might get knocked out. I'm not giving the plot away, but uh, so anyway, um, no, it's great. You know, I, I love rugby. Yeah. And um, so I'm playing the South African coach in this. So yeah. I'm playing, a, you know, played a couple of South Africans before. Um, so no, we, we're here, and then we move to Parker Scarlets this week now. Yeah. To film the final. And uh, rumour has it that Nigel Owens is going to be reffing it. Oh, so, um, all you rugby fans, you know. I, uh, I'm friends with Nigel, so uh, I'm going to give him a tenner and make sure that uh, South Africa win. <laughs> okay. um, yeah, last question. Now, yeah. I'm, I absolutely love my shoes. What's your best pair of shoes that you've got? Ooh. This is like a big one. For me. I absolutely love my shoes. So. Right. All right, what's your, mo- what's your favourite pair and what's your most expensive pair, if you don't mind? Probably my most expensive pair is... I've got a couple of pairs of cowboy boots, right? Um, so that would probably be... I don't know, obviously cost me 130 quid or something. And yeah. um, one of my favourite pairs of shoes is that I got a, a pair of Timberland boots. Nice boots. Um, yeah, they would probably be my favourite shoes. Oh, brilliant. Right, thank you so much for doing this interview Welcome. with me. Welcome. That's all right. right. Can you tell them to subscribe, yeah? Subscribe to, what's Hit, it again? Hitman Howell. Subscribe to this guy, Hitman Howell, right? He yes. speaks sense, he's truthful. Keep it real. Thank you so much.